Hey everybody, D-Dub coming at you from New York City with a fabulous, fabulous guitar from Grez Guitars in Petaluma, California, USA. This guitar, this model I should say, is called the Folsom. <laughs> This uh, guitar was shipped to me a few days ago and I've barely been able to stop playing it. Um, it's a really, really wonderful instrument. I'm going to give you some particulars on it and then I'm going to give you a little sonic tour of it as well. Uh, the scale is uh, 25 inches, which as you know is just a hair shorter than a Fender and a hair uh, longer than a Gibson. Uh, it has jumbo frets. Uh, it has a Macassar ebony fretboard and Honduras mahogany neck. Uh, it is made with basswood finished in nitrocellulose. Uh, basswood was chosen both for its snappy response uh, as well as its light weight. Uh, it doesn't feel like a feather, it feels just right. I mean, it's, it's got just enough heft, uh, but it's not too heavy, not even close. Um, Firebird style pickup in the neck, Broadcaster style pickup in the bridge. Uh, it's got a Bigsby as you can plainly see. It's outfitted with a mastery bridge, but there's other combinations. So if you want some other, uh, you know, a, a Tele style bridge or another style bridge, talk to the folks at Grez and they'll hook you up. So, um, you already heard uh, what the, um, oh, let me just give you a quick rundown on the, uh, on the gear that you're hearing the guitar through. Uh, Blackface Princeton from the mid-60s, uh, a uh, carbon copy, a uh, delay pedal for a little bit of definition, and a uh, fat general compression pedal with just a little bit of compression on. And uh, you can... It's got some some real spank to it, and here's some uh, neck pickup, the clean tone. So you can't go wrong there. I'm not much of an in-between guy, uh, but if you want to hear it. There's your in-between sound. Uh, now, let's get crunchy. Let's start with the... Um, with the neck pickup, which um, it, you can't get a bad sound out of this pickup. <laughs> Great sounding pickup. And uh, when you're ready to unleash the hounds of hell. 